the whole part with Odin once so his hat has hit. What did I miss? Basically, well, it was just like the death scene and like, uh, what's his name was going after, uh, Eivor was going after Fulke and Odin was like, no, no, she's done her part. Right. You've got your brother back. You don't need to continue. And he was like, no. And she was like, meanwhile, trying to open his mind up. Because apparently she's saying that uh, he converted Sigurd. Is that the last of them? We have beaten them back for now. But without Guthrum's army, we do not have the numbers to so, hold this fort. And then we had somebody we come into chat and spam that a bunch of stuff. Is. So I had to block them and then make sure that that word is on my, uh, my band list than it was like i don't know why it didn't activate but that happened too <laughs> guthrum was hasty in his judgment eivor you are fit to stand with the best of us go to your brother the words of one beloved will heal him faster than herbs I will see to matters here. May the gods guide you, Uber. Until we meet again. One sec, I'm just making sure that this is enabled. Maybe they are. Hey, um. Yo, Bex. Try saying hi real quick. Just like literally H I. You might get timed out for a second, but I'll untime you out. But I just want to see if this if this works. <laughs> okay, it worked. <laughs> okay. Uh. Uh. All right, there you go. Now you should be good. <coughs> 10 minutes. <laughs> yeah, the first time it like, it uh, times them out for like 600 seconds. And then the second time, I, uh, I think it bans them or something. Wait, try one more time. Say hi one more time. I don't think it'll ban you though, because I untimed you out. Okay, that's where the issue is. All right, I found out. Wait, try one more time. I think I just found it out. All right, yep, I got it. So basically I have all the bad words in the same group. So you have to say all these bad words that I have <laughs> in order for that for that to do that. So I have to make a separate group for every single word it looks like. 
Like there's, I don't know, there's a, they're all very bad words, <laughs> very bad things. So, uh, yeah. Okay. Well, I know it works when you when you did that. Yeah, this person is like freaking out. What the heck is going on? <laughs> Very bad words. Literally. Wow, he traveled back fast. Jeez. Alright, well now I know at least. That's weird though, I don't know why a, you couldn't just like add all the words into the one spot and then, you know, leave it at that, but whatever. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, one more thing. Oh, wait, wait. have you ever watched the movie Shark Boy and Lava Girl? Oh, that's what I forgot to say. Rachel. Did you ever watch Shark Boy and Lava Girl? Huh? They're coming out with a there's a Netflix movie coming out that has them in it. Yeah, they're like the parents of like Huh? Oh. I didn't know. Well I saw the trailer. Yeah, I thought that was crazy. It's called like We Are Heroes or something. Um, Yo, Bex, try this. Uh, or or Crimson, either one of you, say hi, like nine times in one message, and then say hi ten times in one message. So like, hi 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 hi, and then hit enter. If you can. Because I set something else up where if somebody repeats something like 10 times, then it will be like, hey, stop repeating yourself. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten, two. One, two, three, ten. Let me see if I say it. I don't think it does it to me. All right, maybe it didn't. Okay, whatever. I'll look at it later. I thought I set it up, but because it's like minimum 20 characters, uh, and then maybe that's not 20 characters. Back where you belong. Oh, I missed you, my brother. Yeah, you missed me. Once or twice a year. What? You took your time to find me. Was it for this? To enjoy your time on my throne? I did only what you asked of me. And you slew all those who questioned you. That is not what happened. Ranvi, Ranvi will tell you. Oh yeah, we'll see. My dear wife. Brought to me as a gift by her clan to pacify my ambition. Yes, I'm sure she will be the one to tell me the truth. What did that witch Fulke do to you? You cannot even no, you're good. begin you're back. to imagine that the things got I've me seen. anyways, so I appreciate it. What I've <laughs> learned. Born of gods is who I am. No problem, man. A lord of war. A Roman Mars. I know who I am. I know my destiny. And you will not hinder me. Forgive me. I am faint. Tired of the day and all that has passed. 
I need air. Uh -oh. He's been this way since his return. Could you speak with him? Settle his mind? I can try. I speak with Basim real quick. Celebration. Basim, will you not join us? In time, I may celebrate. But tonight is a melancholy mood. I would rather sit here quietly, alone, with my thoughts. I understand. Where's Sigurd? Where's Sigurd gone? Back to where Dag is, probably. One sec. Crush that. Aid me. Be my eyes. There you are, brother. What are you doing here? I was looking for you. Sigurd. Dark died defending my honor? So he claimed. But he was a fool. My honor needs no defense. It is stone solid. Unblemished. I offered him a way out, but... Shh. Say nothing more of the past. It is gone. There is a rift as deep as death between then and now. I was tested, Eivor, in a crucible of blood and fire. And in my agony, I was reborn. You may think me less than I was, but this is not so. I am greater than before. My mind is a wellspring of prophecies, visions that tell me who I truly am. And for all that, I am grateful for my suffering. Sigurd, I want to understand, but all this, all you say makes little sense. Basim saw these things in me. Fulke, too. Despite her cruelty, she spoke the truth. I am more than the man I was. More than this hobbling stick that stands before you. You must look harder, Eivor. Deeper. See for yourself what they found in me. Do you see it? My greater self. I... I don't know what that means. Look. This is the face of a god. I see only my brother and my truest friend returned to where he is loved and cherished. Where he's meant to be. You are kind. But your eyes are clouded by the past. A place I can no longer see. I fear our paths diverged long ago. Go. I wish to be alone. Return to my feast and drink for me. Celebrate the days to come in my name. He's gone mad. This is gonna be a mess, man. He's back. But at what cost? You're gonna have the part of the community that supports him, and then the other part that's like, no, Eivor was here when you weren't, and he helped everyone. We'll see, though. Looks like I have a new letter. Now it seems the wind calls me back to Randvi. This... New letter. Ship Garlofs. 
Now it seems the wind calls me back to Rantvi. Let's tell her the good news. And it said that I had one more, though. Nice to see you. What happened yesterday? You and Sigurd disappeared during the feast. <laughs> and when he returned, he went straight to our room without a word. We talked for a time. I asked many questions, but got few answers. I wish I could say more. Sigurd wants to blame me for every mishap that has befallen him, but gives me no credit for his rescue. I don't understand. Yet he does speak with you. With me, he has gone totally silent. So, what now? This is for Sussex. We burned it to the ground to save one man. Yet he is barely the man we were searching for. Quite so. <laughs> the new one just popped up. Nice. Alright, let's check the uh, map, I guess. I want to see the Alliance map. Two twenty. Six. Uh, Lincoln, that, and this one. Go, Rick. Go to Essex. Knock that out. What of Essex? We received a summons from the Elderman and his Lady of Colchester, requesting you specifically for a matter of great secrecy. Foreboding. And who is this Elderman? One of King Alfred's lackeys? According to my scouts, he is a man who cares more for his own indulgences than the safety of his people. Approach with care. I will leave at once. Uncommon An alliance at Essex would be invaluable, but go with caution. Can't speak with Bassam? I just realized. I never knew that that was that that was the room. What? <laughs> All right, we've got our next objective. Uh, let me check something here. That's where we need to get to. I was there one time before. And it doesn't look like there's really an easy way to get there either. Okay. Well, I'll fast travel here. The indicator. All right, nice. All right, and I'm gonna hop off of the thing here. Troll. There it is. Ah! Grab this. Give me the arrows. Arrows full. Okay. Uh, let me check skills then. You got a new weapon. Opus. And new other stuff here. Markle has seen ability. Oh, incendiary power, power trap. Power can be detonate, detonated a second time. Huh. It's kind of cool. I'll take the explosive trap there. Turbo combo. Like, oh, dual swap. I don't know if I would ever really use the dual swap thing. Fire build up. What's this uh, top left? Pick 
that one next. All right, chat. Um, what I'm gonna do real quick is I'm gonna I uh, go check it, see what if we have any food, and I probably eat something actually this time. Um, so I will be right back, and then we'll continue here. So uh, be back in like ten minutes or so, maybe a little less, hopefully. All right, chat. I'm back. Let's uh run this here. Forget the area that we're even going to right now. Uh, we are going to Essex. Right, right, right. So, actually, before we get there, now I'll just get this one. I don't need that one. That's okay. Oh, don't spew hog shit. We both know it's because you're shut. There we go. So we'll grab the uh, the synchronization point once we get there. And uh, kind of go from there. Let's refresh that. Best not to draw attention here. Stand back. Best not to. I'm really traveling right now. <laughs> Which way is it taking me, though? Actually. Why wouldn't it have... Oh, okay, I see. Because it looks like the main roads only lead up to... Wait, really? Why are we going through here when we can go through the other way? Yeah! Sometimes it's a little faster to go your own route. There we go. Flip it around. And we get to take a little bit of a scenic route by going through the forest instead. Wants me to go back again. Unless if this road ends somewhere. Wait, what? Yeah. I'm so confused. Come out of there and face God's justice, devil!
All right, we made it. Hey, and we're detected. Off to a good start. It's like a mini room. I will climb to the top. Hopefully. All right, there it is. I was gonna. I was nervous that it was going to be a completely different building or something and not the one that we're on, but right here, that works out. Nice. Now we have a fast travel point as well. Seems Elderman Beerstan has made this ruin his longhouse. Ooh. Why is my cup empty? Perhaps because you have drunk the barrel dry? Damn, Beerstan. His household is as poorly run as his land. Bestrid is a good boy. It's up on the second floor. Far better than he deserves. You would say that, Adrian. You would say that, Adrian. Your wife has... Here they are. You! Guards will come at one cry from me! Sheathe your blade, lady. Oh. I'm Eivor of the Raven Clan, here at your husband's request. Another Dane. I am Estrid, wife of the Lord of Essex. As you may have heard, my lord is not at home. If he's away, I'll speak to you. Oh, that you could, Eivor, for I am sure this hall would shake with our merry wit. But your accord must be reached with him. You don't strike me as a meek Saxon wife. Do you yet see an ember of my Frankish fire, Ravenwalker? Perhaps it dances in my eyes? I'm wary of rounding up Saxons. Is your husband stolen, drunk, or wayward? He'll be stalking the woodlands today, hunting game and ignoring the vital affairs of Essex. One such affair is why we called for you. If I can find him, I'll remind him of his duties. Ah, such would be a miracle. His favorite haunt is southwest of here. The lavender fields there attract the prey, God help him. One With second, luck, he sir. hasn't been eaten, but I'll return either way. i to figure this out. One second. Uh, let's see.
the heck, my thing is not updating. Ay, ay, ay. There it is, geez. All right, so we need to find this camp now. <laughs> oh man, I knew I should have gotten the one out there. Dear Estrid, we must discuss the affairs of this land. yes. Alderman's house. All right, let's head there. And I hate these the these uh, distrust areas. I always get spotted so fast. Friend wrote tattoo. Uh, he wrote his test answers on his tattoos so he could read it. <laughs> That's so funny and smart, actually. Hunting is, is a it? fine sport. His hand I hope the ultimate has like not become too. the prey. Survey the area, Sunan. No good comes from a camp this bloody. Off guard as they supped. The remains of the hunting party. This one was savaged by a large animal. They were attacked by a beast, something strong enough to kill a horse. Some large prey left these tracks in the grass. The hunters were prey to a large beast or two. I can only hope that Biestam still lives. I'm just Threat search your wings, for him Sunan. over there. Houston, ready your <laughs> weapon or accept your fate as a feast for bears. Do not let them charge you. <laughs> we'll fight to the death, <laughs> worthy one. Huh? Yeah, I did. <laughs> your weapon strikes true. <laughs> You have savaged enough men today, Well, four. I 
would not have survived this ambush without you. You have my gratitude to stumble upon me in my moment of greatest peril. Perhaps you were godsend. I'm Estridsend. Your wife and the Thanes of Essex both want your balls on a blacksmith's anvil. When do they not? You could return and report that the Savage Claw took me. Poor Beerstan, his exit pursued by a bear. And make the beast Lord of Essex in your stead. <laughs> no doubt my Estrid would prefer his velvet paws to my calloused hands. So, who are you? A sellsword? I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. You hinted at an alliance for the loan of my unique talents. It's blood, yes. Let us return to Colchester at once, and we'll speak more of the delicate matter on my mind. I like I'm this glad guy you answered so my far. summons. I did not expect such a skilled fighter. It's good I came when I did. You lost many men on this hunt. Good men, all. They will have the proper rights, and their families will be cared for. Your people sacrificed much for your sport. They did. There is no balm for my tortured heart. Why did you ask me here? Do you believe in true love, Eivor? I have loved. But have you truly? Has a longing burned in your breast, a sweet lingering pain, paralyzing you with its sting? There's pain enough in battle. I do not seek it out in love. I long for it. The thrill of a fight softly won. Eivor! I'm coming, I'm coming. What was I saying? I long for oh it. My God, dude. The thrill of a emails fight every single day. One. My wife Estrid lacks fire. A stupid thing. She is a fish out of water, cold, <sighs> dead. She showed great passion when I met her, keeping your thanes in check. Oh, they love her, it is true. Some with too much devotion. And I have not been a good and attentive husband. I have always been a plucked goose in matters of love. And a piss poor ruler to boot. Strong must be the hand that steers the ship, Beston. My hand would rather tug the cat gut of a well crafted bow, my eyes narrowing at the sight of prey. Aye, a crown sits heavy on the head. Then let us run wild and free in the woods as the wolves do. Live on our wits. Oh. Close one. An uncommon proposition. Need to cloak myself here. Then let us run wild and free in the woods as the wolves do. Live on our wits, prowl and stalk and feast. You have a romantic way about you, Biston. Do not fret. My guards will not worry you when we are together. You mismark me if you think I'm capable of worry. Have you built your city in the ruins of another? No, these builders are lost to the annals of time. Far advanced of the Saxon hovels of Wattle and Daub, I have ambition to build a great palace myself, with mosaics and balmy courtyards. What stops you? That which stops all but the most creative minds. Coin, imagination, talent. And your people? Is Essex happy? That is a question I never really ponder. I suppose they are. I hope they are. Alfred believes I rule like a chickless hen, flapping and squawking over nothing but the farmer's dinner. He interferes. No, he disapproves. Is that not infinitely worse? But look, we are nearing my hall. I must face the wolves at my door before we discuss your favor to Essex, Abel. It may be I can speed your business along. Common proposition. Elder Man's house. Fend off the spears of their displeasure. Let them speak their woes. I'll advise you if I can. Who is this owl, Beerston, that twitters in your ear? An advisor, nothing more. Here to help Essex navigate her brewing storms. Now, my dear brethren. Adrid, perhaps you will start us off. What troubles you? You're a disgrace, Beerstan. Couldn't get a sow pissed in an alehouse. 
Alfred's men are crawling all over Essex. King Alfred, yes. Though it is within his right, the constant presence of his men is certainly an issue. In the back, they will soon grow bored of meddling, full grown in strength, mistletoe stood. Are they men or babes? If Alfred meddles in the affairs of Essex, send his men home in shrouds. Ah, we should challenge his right to rule. Was not Essex once a thriving kingdom of its own? We should fight, yes, fight! And you, Wyatt, what do you say? Your preparations for the Lammas Festival. How can you think Lamas. of spending so much coin when your people are starving? Mine and song is the answer to my problem. You should contribute to the festivities. Nor fasting come to the feast. He should put his own ham fist in his purse and contribute coin to the festival. Yes. You worry about the cost of such a festival. One that thanks God for our great harvest. Uh, contribute your own coin then. And Aldrich, do you yap like a she-hound as Adred does? You know my thoughts, Beerston. The feared. How can we give men to Alfred for his wars when our harvest suffers day by day? If your men here in the fields, fields would be mean nothing. Ugh. Mean nothing if your land is taken. Okay, where are the sleep? Which Do they not defend your land? You'll need all the men you can muster to fight the coming wars. The Danes are a great threat when provoked. Those we cannot ally with, we must fight or lose our lands. There. Have I not answered all your questions? You are a stain on this shire, Beerstan. Useless. Useless. That's right. What? Yet still you haunt my hall. Be gone. I haven't time for your squabbling. They all just nodded in agreement, everything that we said, and they all just said I was useless. What do you mean? That ceased their prattling. A fine outcome, Abel. The very soul of balance. A firm hand is all you need, Beerston, whether on your hunting bow or on your helm. All this talk of hunting makes me long for the woods. Your wife awaits, Beerston. Aren't you worried some other man will drench your sheets with his sweat? Ha! <laughs> she does as she must. As do I. But you will discover this soon enough. You have done the impossible, Dane. Returned my errant gander to his coop. My pettish love. Such a stormy countenance clouds the sun of my return. Your thanes drank the ale the abbot gifted us. All of it. Now <laughs> that is a tragedy my heart will not easily overcome. If he looked at me with the same affection he shows for hunting deer, our marriage might have survived. So, what do you need of me? Our affairs are more of heart than of state, Eivor. What little passion there was between us faded into bickering long ago. We would have our freedom, Eivor. I from my wife, and my wife from Essex. I'm too sharp a weapon for so soft a task. Why not part and be done with it? Oh, were I a Dane, and divorce as simple as a slit throat. But it's not so easy as that. God prevents it, your king prevents it. Uh, your king? Explain yourselves, clear and plain, and I will do it. The poetry here is mind mud. We had a plan, a simple plan. A woman lost and a woman found. Some time ago, we paid a Dane to kidnap me and ferry me safely to Francia. As you can see, he did not deliver. He was <laughs> certainly thorough in other regards. Some Norse <laughs> can be quick to take coin and slow to earn it. If I give my word, it is not broken. Could we try the kidnap again? Much of the planning is done. It would only take a more trustworthy overseer. It should be a bold venture if we do. Loud and brash and seen by all. During our Lamas festival, merry peasants and guards with wandering eyes. Your return to Francia would need a swift ship, with a captain ready to leave England. We could ask him. I would have thought his steed and seamen spent. Come find me in the market, Evo. Our unwelcome guests require food and ale to soften their anger. My wife is a gracious and attentive host, Evo. 
the only thing that keeps my braying thanes at bay. And the woman found? A darling maybud, Alvida, my childhood sweetheart. I left her 20 years ago in Malden to marry my prickled pear. <laughs> 20 years? Can an ember so cold be reignited? We can hope. You must fan the flame. Find her, bring her to my lakeside cottage, and light a bonfire there. I will know to come. I believe she lived in the last house in Malden. A small, sweet place where fond memories were made. I will do as you both ask, and ask Freya for success in this love game. Good luck in your endeavors, Eivor. I pray you find my Alvida with a fair face and a yearning heart. Now, should I look for Alvida first, or meet with Estrid at the marketplace? Very interesting. <laughs> so we need to get rid of his current wife, and uh, <clears throat> bring the other one closer. <laughs> Interesting quest for a Viking. Okay. Whatever we need to bring uh, the alliance together, I guess. Uh, let me see here. Guided arrow. I guess I'll go after this thing. It's basically a drama show now, literally. <laughs> Alright, cool. And uh, right here, I think I'm actually going to end a little bit early tonight. So I can try to get to sleep at the right time tonight and everything. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is stop actually right here. And then tomorrow we'll pick up right where we're at and continue. Um, I think I might do Jackbox tomorrow night, possibly, like after we play for a few hours of success.